So hi everyone, it's five o'clock and this is Shruti Bhatt here from Artsy Craftsy Mom. Oh, this side, this side, Artsy Craftsy Mom. Okay, I'm a craft blogger from Bangalore and I share a lot of fun ideas for kids and moms. You know, you can make a lot of animal crafts, you can do a lot of art activities. My blog has everything. Okay, so today um, the toying team has invited me to give a good demo. You know, it's already day 10 of the 21 day lockdown. We still have few days to go. So I wanted to share some fun ideas which you could try at home yourselves, right? Hi, Sia. With this lockdown, right, it's really difficult for us to keep busy all the time. You know, we don't want to be eating our mummies and papa's heads when we are at home, right? We should be able to use our time more creatively. So the PNG team and I smile team came up with lots of ideas to have these videos one every day so that you can learn new things make new things and have fun yeah I know 10 days are over 11 days are left but it seems like a long time right hi hi everybody mine I think is the session 7 so there are six more before me. Be sure to go back and check them out. And oops. Are you guys able to see me? Okay. Hi Seema. So today we are going to do two things. Okay, two crafts. We are going to make a nice parrot. Can you see the parrot? This nice fat chubby parrot. Okay, is going to come into your house. And we are also going to make a boat which can rock. It's a rocking boat. Okay. Are you excited? Yay, good. So let me go over all the materials that you require. We will be starting, okay? Make sure you have that. So tell me whether you have that or not, okay? I will name one material and you tell me whether you have it or you don't have it, okay? So the first one is some white papers or you can use colored paper, okay, any colored paper. It does not have to be yellow, red and green because parrots are usually that color. I said we'll use those colors, but it's up to you. You can use any colors. You can make a purple parrot, you can make a blue parrot, you can make a black parrot, anything's fine, okay. And once this lockdown is over and you can go and buy new color papers, then you can recreate it. Or if you get your hand at white papers, do like what I do. We will be coloring it. Okay? All ready to start? Give me a thumbs up and then I'll start. We have a small one also and we have a big one too. So we'll make the board first, okay? This is a simpler of the crafts and you need lesser materials. Yes, good. How many sheets? Uh, you'll need one sheet for the board. You'll need one sheet for the parrot. Good. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to move myself to the little side so that you can see the materials that I have on my table. Okay, give me a second. Can you see the magic happening? Ah. 
I have some white paper, I have some scissors, I have black sketch pen, I have glue sticks. Can you see me? And you can see the paper here, my finger. Give me a thumbs up. And you can see, and we need some color sketch pens if you have, or you can use crayons if you have. Okay, anything is fine. Okay, we'll move all this aside. We'll take our first paper. Oops, hold that pen. Don't move. Okay, so we have our paper. I'm going to start with the white paper, but if you have yellow paper, you can start with the yellow paper. You can do this on the yellow paper. Okay. Okay, now you can see me clear. Now quickly, I hope you've got a small, medium sized plate and a small bowl. We will need this to make the body. Now where's my parrot? My parrot is here. See? Can you see the size? So this will make a big parrot. So if you use two small things, you'll get a smaller parrot. Where's my smaller parrot? Oh, Polly is hiding. Okay, here she comes. So this is a smaller parrot. So if you use a smaller circle and a still smaller circle, you can use that. So start from using the plate first. Can you see the plate? Yes. Switch off the comment box. Why baby? Okay. So the first step is at the corner of the page. Can you see the corner of the page? Yeah, here. So we don't want to waste paper, right? So we'll keep at the corner. Take any pencil or sketch pen, whatever you have with you. Trace out a big circle. Did you see the big circle? Yeah. Now we need to make its face, right? So we'll use some space here. Again, let's not waste too much space. Can you see the circle clearly? Yes. I want to show you half half screen because I want to sh show you what I'm doing, right? So that you can see. I hope it's clear. Is it disturbing too much? I'll show it to you with full screen also again. Okay. Now we'll make a small circle. Right. This will become the head of the parrot. Right. We have the face and we have the body. What do you think is missing? We need the beak. Do you know how to draw the beak of a parrot? Have you seen the beak of a parrot? Like this. Right? So, I will show you how to draw that. Okay? Let me know if you can follow along. So, what space is left here, right? We'll use this space for the tail. We need to have a tail. So, we have some more space here. Right? White paper. If you have colored paper, cut out with red color. Hmm? Or you can do it like how I'm doing on white paper. Now to make the beak, can you see me clearly? Yes. <laughs> okay. So what we do is we make like a big curve. Okay. Can you see this curve? Like an upside down U. Okay. Then we do it like this. Okay. And we make one more space from here and make it half because it has to have a sharp beak, right? Right, we drew the beak. Now you look at my board and tell me what else is missing. Oh, we need a crown. Right? Are you with me till now? Do you want me to wait? Have you drawn the big circle and the small circle and the beak? Oh, let me move the beak a little bit up. Good job. Okay, I'll wait. Don't worry. Don't worry. We can go over each step slowly. Okay, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. 
So we drew a big circle with a pledge. We drew a small circle with a bowl. Then we drew a beak. How to draw a beak? Make an ulta U. Then make it a pointy one. And then do this. Yes? Okay, I will remove this. Can you see that? Okay, can you see that? Now what else is missing? We need the crown. So let's make the crown. That's easy. So you do it. One, two, three. Okay? And then you make it long. You keep it long. So that when we cut it, you have some space to stick. What else is our parrot missing? What about its tail? We need a long tail. You know what's the easiest way to make a tail? You keep three fingers, right? Keep it at the top. Okay, this is where the paper ends, right? So keep it at the top. So go ahead and make this. Open your fingers a little. Yeah, you have that. Now you make it a little longer. Okay. You can make the feathers a little longer. Okay. So let me go through that again. You see the bird. This is its head. This is its body. This is its crown. This is its... Okay, let me... Keep it up. Because I think that logo is coming in between, right? Can you see the beak also? We are doing the bird first. I said we'll do the boat first, but then I started with the bird. So we'll do the drawing of the bird first. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, don't worry. Okay. Is everybody done with this step? Good job. Is anybody going to use uh, poster colors? Then you might need to get some brushes. If you're using sketch pens, go ahead. If you're using crayons, we are ready to start. You let me know when everybody is done till this step and we will start. Okay? Okay, we'll start with the next steps. We are going to start coloring. Okay? Let's color the body first. First we'll decide what color our body is going to be. So if you have used color paper, you don't need to color. Or if you have taken yellow color, then use red, green on top of it. Okay? Coloring time. Yes. So we are going to use, I'm going to use sketch pen. But you can easily use crayon. I will show you what I have done with crayons. Okay? I have kept here. So you can do with crayons. Or you can do with sketch pen. Right? Crayons, very good. So I will keep this here. For your reference, you can use crayons any way you want, okay? We are going to color the body first. Okay, what I am going to do, I am going to use sketch pens. Okay, start from the top. Don't worry about going out because anyway we are going to cut it out, right? If you are using crayons, you can use this design or you can follow what I am doing, okay? Then fill up that space. Don't worry if it goes out because we are going to cut it out. So you can do this fast, 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 right? You can use a crayon. Are you coloring with me? Right? Everybody is done till here. There's no definite shape. Let it go out. You want me to show you? See. Oops. See, even it's gone out. So don't worry about it being perfect. You can use crayons. You can use sketch pens. You can use 
poster colors if you want right any poster colors use your finger can you see this clearly yeah once you're done with red choose any color that you want you want to do orange we'll do orange fill this up what is annoying sneem seema what's wrong are you able to see it clearly can you see it clearly you want me to show you clearly can you see it like i said let it come out no problem let there be white spots no problem we are doing the activity this is the activity we are making the parrot right so if you're doing crayons you can even do this you can do red outside yellow inside green inside okay like this if you're using sketch pens you can do this type design also or you can put dots also like you know like feathers i'm waiting i'm waiting don't worry i'm waiting don't worry at all okay i know it takes time to color we'll do it slowly no problem you can fill up the colors later also once we join our parrot that time also you can fill up there is no problem you don't have to finish coloring now it's just easy okay we can cut and then whatever space is remaining that also we can color later not a problem so don't worry we are starting yellow not green you can use green not a problem there's no fixed color right you can add purple if you want okay you want some green shall we do some green what a colorful parrot you can leave it half done also no problem we will color it afterwards okay are you with me till now Shall I color the last part? We have lot of coloring to do, so don't worry. Use your crayons. Yep. If you're using crayons, perfect. Do your own pattern. You can even make it like a check parrot. It's your parrot. Okay. Perfectly all right. That is the fun in art, you know. You can look at what is real and then make your own thing. it's perfect i'm just going ahead and coloring the last one again don't worry if it comes out outline it and then fill it it's faster with sketch pens it will be a little slower with crayons so don't worry about it you can fill it up later also coloring okay painted the body wow that's a wonderfully colorful parrot don't use orange color use yellow use green use purple any color that you have if you use gray color paper you won't be able to see the color on top of it right so use some light color paper it could be white it could be cream it could be a uh, little bit of yellow that is all fine because otherwise if you use a dark color paper you won't be able to color on it so what you can do at that time is you can cut out colored paper if you have other color paper and stick it on it that is also fine but you can't color on it right you won't be able to see those colors everybody is finished coloring the body thank you plaksha 
I'm sure my little Polly will be really, really happy. See, hi. Yes, if you don't have orange color paper, perfectly fine. If you have yellow, use yellow. If you have green, use green. Any color is fine. Okay. Shall we color the beak now? That's simple, right? Where's the beak? Now you beak. Where's the beak? Now your parrot can have yellow beak or where's it? Red beak or a black beak. Whatever you want. Okay. Shall we do that? <laughs> That's so sweet. I'll wait, I'll wait. We can always come back to the coloring, okay? Don't worry about it. We'll do the beak because it's very simple. All you need to do is take some yellow, fill it up. Because cutting will take time, no? We'll finish off the coloring. Even if you're not able to color it now, it's okay. Don't worry. Okay? We can always finish the coloring after we stick it also. Okay? Don't worry. Who all have done till here? You want me to wait? You want me to show you? Okay. How do I show? Yeah. There you go. No problem. Take your time for the body. Okay? We also have to look at the time now. Now we'll draw a big guy. You know what we'll do? We'll finish the uh, cutting. Then we'll do the coloring for the rest. Okay? See, now I'm not going to color this. Okay? We will color it later. I would just want to show you. Hmm? Yes, perfectly. So what we have done is you can just take some red color paper. Right? If you have cut it in the red color paper, you can directly use red color paper. You can cut it in yellow paper. That will make it faster. You can just color the body. You can use a yellow tail and add color on it or you can just leave it yellow. Not a problem at all. Any shape is fine. This shape is also fine. Okay? There are multiple ways to do things. So this bird has colorful thing and then she has a black eye and a beak and yellow okay we will color it later also not a problem because i know it's taking a lot of time for you to color and you're being really imaginative we'll finish the cutting first okay now always use child safe scissors right so you have blunt edges on the top so this has to be facing away from your body all the time. I'm not going to color this in this right now. Okay. So don't cut it like this. And don't cut it like this. <gasps> no, 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 no. Always point it away from you. Make sure the pointy bit is away. And then cut it. If you're finding it difficult, you can ask your parents to help. Okay. I'm going to cut out each part. If you're done coloring or even if you're not done coloring, we'll start cutting, okay? We'll color later. No problem. We have a lot of time to color it. Cut the body. Take somebody's help, please. If you're finding it difficult. Scissors away from your body. Right? You can ask your elder brother or elder sister to help you cut fast. You can ask your parents to help you cut fast. Okay. We have the body and we have the beak. Right. We are cutting out the crown now. We will assemble it and color it. I just wanted to show you both the options. Okay. Because the body is the main part. No. That's why. Okay. 
if this round round thing is difficult for you to cut let me show you one easy way okay so for this bird we did it you see this we just a rectangle and we have cut long strips okay you can do like that also it's up to you whatever is easier for you can you see it yeah you can see this this is a simple shape to cut so cut out a rectangle and cut some strips you can do that too or if you are really good at cutting then you cut this okay now we will cut out the face where is the face but it's not a colored face i have just drawn the eye everybody is here till now hmm keep the scissor pointed away from your body keep it flat on a surface don't worry about the exact shape go ahead and cut it okay you have the body the beak and the crown and the face and lastly we'll cut out the tail also okay are you with me till now are you able to cut it out is it too fast yes because i am an expert at cutting no but i can cut and i can wait and i'll wait for you to follow okay okay we have this okay now you decide where you want to put it okay now we put the body here we want to put the beak here and we want to put the head here and we want to put the crown here yes can you see a funny parrot now half colored and half not colored ah uh, can you help her cut it then if there's a young child can you help her cut it or can you call your mama and papa yes and while you're doing it please ask your mama and papa to take a photo so that you can send it to me and show me right okay not ready okay i'll wait for two more minutes okay because we need to finish it fast <laughs> okay what we are going to do is we'll assemble it now let's put the tail first okay we are putting the tail sticking the tail i took the glue stick and i stuck it behind see okay same way you can put a little bit of glue stick it okay and you can put a little bit of glue on the front put this behind a little bit of glue here and put it here see a parrot is ready but is it ready now we can color it right i'm going to make my parrot red right so you can color it if you have some space left before while coloring that's what i said so you can color it after sticking also right i hope you've called your mummy papa to take some pictures of you doing it and also take a picture once you're done finishing it i'll tell you who and where you can share it yes say share it with sanika and fatima upload it to the png app are you having fun and is your parrot looking pretty magic parrot yes now i'm going to make one feather red because who likes a white parrot you know i'm going to make this half yellow maybe make it a little green 
Wow, now that's a magic funky parrot. And we have a parrot ready. Who is done? Look at that. Raj, are you guys done? Right? Like I said, if you're using crayons, it'll look like this. Bigger strokes are easier to color. If you're using sketch pens, it'll look like this or like this. You can use watercolors, you can use any kind of paint. Okay? So what we did was when we cut out the big circle, we stuck the small circle, drew an eye, put a crown, put this. You can stick it from behind, okay? And the tail. And now you can finish the coloring. Everybody is done? Yes, if you are done, ask your mama and papa to click a picture. Be sure to send it, okay? Okay, we are getting ready for our next one. This is very easy. This is very fast. In 10 minutes you can do. Mitu Pitu, nice. I like that name. Mitu Mitu Popart. Or Tota Raja. You know, nice names. My parrot is a silly parrot. It just likes to make jokes. Shall we start with the boat? This is very easy, very fast also. Chubby parrot, very nice. I'll keep the parrot here so that you can keep watching and how to color it. I'm going to start with the next one because this is also similar. Okay. I'll keep the small parrot here so that you can keep watching. This is also very similar. Poppy, nice name. And chubby parrot. Yes, I like chubby parrots. It's a fat parrot. No, this one. Mr. Silly. Wow. Shall we make the boat? And then we can come back and color both of them. What do you say? Okay, this time I'm going to take colored paper. Okay. We are going to trace out a circle. Same way like before. Okay. Right. And the pa and the boat needs a steamer. So we are going to have a steamer which is a rectangle. And another which is like a half F. Okay. Can you draw these two things? And we're going to start cutting it out. I think I was a little slow while teaching. It's the same steps like what we use for the parrot. So don't be confused. You can use white paper or you can use yellow paper. It's going to be the same. Okay. Okay. Are you all seeing this? I have only 45 minutes. What to do? 
I can keep talking for hours together. Okay, and I have lot of videos for you to share. You have to keep learning new new things, no? I have about 10 minutes left. So we'll finish this board and then we'll come back again, don't worry. So you saw this board, we cut out a circle, right? Can you see that? Now what we have done is we have folded it in half. Okay. Hi Ritwik. We folded it in half. And this will be the body of the boat. Now if you keep it like this, oh because my fan is on, otherwise it will rock. It will rock like this, right? It's a rocking boat. Now we cut out the steamer. This will be fast for us. See, you can do it fast. Like a speed racing. You know, minute to minute. We can finish the boat in a minute. Not in a minute, 10 minutes. Okay, we cut out one thick steamer. Now you see this F like thing. Is it F or is it a half T? We're cutting this part out. Now I used a yellow paper. You can use a white paper. Okay, not a problem. Any color paper. You can use a green color paper. You can use a black color paper. Okay. We'll clean up the space. Okay. We have three things. Let's get it assembled first. Can you see my three things of the boat? Yep. We'll assemble it first and then we will color. Yeah. Please share it on stories. You can tag me. You can tag the toying page team. Right? You could send it to your HR so that they can send it to the toying team so that I can have a look and I can write a special thank you note for you to share it. Yeah? I hope you're having a good time, right? Make sure you ask your mama and papa to see the WhatsApp photos and videos. I want to see them. Otherwise, they'll be so sad. And my parrot also will be very sad. It wants to meet the other parrots, no? And say hi to all your Mitu parrot and all the other parrots. Yeah? Hmm. Okay. Now we are going to put the steamers on the top. Very simple. Just color, put the glue on the top and stick it. Okay. Do we have this ready? Yep. Now to color it, before that we will make some windows. Okay. Draw one circle. Another circle. Another circle. Yes, you can send it to Jovin also, any team. They will make sure that I see it. They will make sure that your HR sees it, right? Did you have fun? Please tell me you had fun. Otherwise, I'm going to start crying. <laughs> okay, so we'll make those three windows. The boat needs, big ships need windows, right? Because you want to go inside and see it. You see what I'm doing here? Can you see what I'm doing? Right? Then now you can color it. You can color the top part. Green. I want my boat to be green. Now you can take your time and color it. Any color you want. You want to make it brown, make it brown. You want to make it green, make it green. Yeah. Now I want to make this part red. You can make it brown. Are you with me till now? Have you guys started with the boat? Good job. You don't like? Why didn't you like? You didn't like my crafts? You are coloring the top of the steamer now? Okay, you can do the coloring around, say you don't have to finish it in the 45 minutes that I'm showing. I'm just showing you how to do it. You can watch the replay, you can make a lot of crafts, right? Are you taking pictures? Are you asking your mama and papa to help? Thank 
cute, Ruthwick. I love you. You can add some designs on it, right? On your boat. You can add some lines if you want. This is all decorating, okay? You can do this however you want. Maybe you can add some dots. Can you see the dots? Yeah. Here. So you, our boat is ready. Look at that. The big boat, medium boat. Okay. Again, the same thing you can do with crayons also. If you're coloring with crayons, you can see it here, right? Very simple things to do. All you need is circles so now you know your shapes if you have a circle then you can make anything you can make a boat you can make a parrot you saw how we did that right and you can make a lot of things right we have four more minutes left so you could make a monkey look at this look at the monkey you could make a monkey again this is one circle another circle some small circles right you could make a crab. See, Mr. Crab. Look at that. This is the same like what we've done with the board. So this is one circle folded. You just add some eyes. So you can make your own stuff. Lots of them. So what did we make today? Two things. One was our parrot. Right? And one was the boat. Did you see how to make the boat? Which? See, here are two things that we did today. Our boat and Polly the parrot, right? Let me know what you think. Did you like this session? Make sure you hold your drawings in your hand and ask your mama and papa to take a picture. You can make a lot of stuff. You can come visit me. Check me out on Instagram. Check me out on YouTube. I'm also there on Facebook. I have a blog called, where's that, oops, right, artsycraftsymom.com, right, I want to see all your pictures, make me really, really, really happy, okay, let me know in comments if you like today's session, yes, yes, you have to name your parrots and name your boats also, because a boat without a name is not fun, right? Share your feedback in the comments or let your HR know. If you want to learn more art projects or craft projects, you can call me again. I would love to come and do another session. Right? Adya, Arya enjoyed it. Do you have any questions for me on how to do crafts? You don't have to worry about what you have. The same craft, you could have done it with newspapers. Or if you have a paper plate, you can do it with a paper plate. Right? So don't let... What things you don't have limit you. So if you see a craft on YouTube which uses different materials, make it your own. If you don't have yellow color, use purple color. If you don't have green color, use blue color. Right? In another one minute, we will be signing off. Once again, bye from my poly picture. And boy from the Titanic. I'm going to name this Titanic. Thank you, everybody. I hope you all had fun. Cure. Oh. Inaya, thank you. It's a simple parrot. No, not very difficult. Here. So, see the coloring? If you have not done with the coloring, go ahead and do it again. So you want me to go over the boat and it is time. So this is one circle. We folded it in half, made this and then you color your own. Add windows, add designs, okay? And the parrot. That's all for today. 
See you then. Thank you so much. Bye bye. I don't know when you call me, I'll come. Or you can meet me on Instagram. Ping me on Instagram. Ping me on Facebook. Come on to my blog, leave a comment. See you then. Bye bye. See you tomorrow with a new session. Somebody else will do it. Okay? Bye.